of religion. She is five. It is the first thing she remembers of her youth. Her father, which she loved so much, reading the Holy Bible. She feels the love for her he puts in the words. 8. Dressed in a lovely white skirt, she remembers the lovely pink ribbons. It is warm, summer, walking to church on a Sunday with her family, mother, father and brother. Now she is 14, a young lady, her long blonde hair is going all the way down to her waist. Outside the wind blows. She is looking outside, through the window. Snowflakes from heaven twirl down violently to join the collective. Her mother is standing behind her, combing her hairs. Isn't his creation a wonder, she recalls her saying. 17. Her first love. They had to meet in secret. His leather jacket and oily hair and not the kind of boyfriend her father would want his daughter to have. They are sitting on a bench in the park. She is crying and he is angry. You dumb girl, there is no such thing as a god. You are wasting your life. He wanted more, but she was afraid. Her lord and savior wanted her preserved for the one true man. But he did not understand that. 24. She's going down the aisle. She doesn't know if she will be able to love this man, but her father said his younger cousin was a hard-working guy and a perfect husband for her. 35 years old. She's feeding the baby. The other five children are already in bed. It is late and he still is not home. Looking at the clock. The door opens and her husband walks in drunk as usual. She hopes he won't hit her this day. Maybe this time he will not as she is carrying the baby in her arms. 45 years old, to the hospital again. She knows the doctor from church but she hides the truth from him. But still he says, you fell from the stairs again? The Lord works in mysterious ways. You really should be more careful and listen to your husband. 50 years old. Her youngest daughter, Sarah, just turned 16. On Monday evening, Sarah always goes to church to sing in the church choir. She knows Sarah loves to sing, and the priest had proposed to give her extra lessons. But ever since she had given her daughter permission to follow those lessons, the joy seems gone in her and she always comes home crying. Perhaps the lessons are just too hard for her, but she never asks. 60 years old. She never sees her children anymore and does not understand. The priest would never do the things they claim he did. It is a man of God. Her husband is in jail for drunk driving and killing a person in the process. She still goes to church. The new priest is a nice man too. He seems very driven to understand his flock and she regularly meets with him and speaks of her sorrows, the pains in her life, her disobedient children. And he always nods and says, God's love for you is beyond doubt. There is a reason for all of this. 65 years old. Heart attack flashbacks. There is no pain, but she knows she is going to die. All she ever tried to do was what God wanted her to do. His love she felt all her life. And now she will meet him in... <laughs> she passes out, her eyes closed, but they already were. Her whole life she walked with her eyes closed. If only after death she could open them, then she would see there really is nothing after death. Life is precious. Nature only grants you this one opportunity. Carpe diem.